Hi, I usually don't really do intros, um, but I am running a giveaway, so if you guys are interested, um, just wait until the end of the video and I'll explain everything. I'll try to explain everything, so yeah. Hi, I already went ahead and did one eye off camera and I'm actually using the new Morphe 3503 palette. This is the palette. Um, it's actually really cute. It has a pop of green, which I really like because I love green. But I'm just going to show you guys how I did this look. I kind of fucked up a lot, so I'll probably fuck up on this eye, but that's fine. I'm going to start off with priming my eyelids with the Anastasia Eye Primer. I'm taking the Shaggy Hypnotic and I'm going to use this to outline my crease. And I'm slightly outlining above my natural crease line um, because my eyelids are a little hooded. I'm taking the same color on a blending brush and slightly blending out the edges. I'm taking the shade Unstoppable on another blending brush and I'm going to blend this next to the Hypnotic shade. I'm taking the shade Ball of Fire on another blending brush and blending it on the edges of the Unstoppable shadow. I'm taking the shade Smoked Out and I'm placing this right where I placed the Hypnotic shade. I'm just going to start building up my crease. To help blend the black into like those red shadows, I'm going back with the Hypnotic shade and just like slightly blend those two together. I'm using the same eyeshadow base. I'm going to cut my crease. And since I did the outline at the beginning, I can sort of see where I started. So I'm just going to follow that line to help me cut my crease. I'm taking a synthetic blending brush and I'm gonna use this to pack that in place. I'm going back with the smoked out shadow. I'm gonna start blending out this harsh corner. I'm taking a little tiny detail brush with the smoked out shadow. I'm going to apply some more black on my crease. So just with like a little pencil brush, I'm going over that crease and blending it out. I'm not taking the shade power play and I'm going to place this all over my lid. I'm taking a makeup wipe to clean out my under eye so I can start my lower lash line. I'm taking my L'Oreal Full Wear Concealer and I'm using this to prime my under eyes. And I'm doing the same thing that I did on my crease on my lower lash line. I'm taking this Huda Beauty Lifeline Eyeliner. I'm using the pencil side to apply it on my waterline. Okay, so that was the eyeshadow. I'm gonna move on to my face now. Uh, yeah. I'm using this ColourPop All-Star Matte Blur Primer. It doesn't really blur my face. I just use it kind of like to hydrate my skin instead of like using my moisturizer. To actually blur my pores, I'm using the No Problem Primer from Touch and Soul. I've been picking my skin. So I have like these little sons of bitches. For foundation, I'm using the Super Stay by Maybelline in the shade 312. I actually got a darker shade, so this kind of matches better. So I'm just going to apply this everywhere. I'm gonna use this brush to buff it in first and then use my sponge. 
I'm taking a mixture of these concealers because one is too light and this one is like what I want but not light enough, you know? So I just like mix them together. I put the one that's like not so light in the center of my face because I like my under eyes being a lot brighter than the rest of my face. To blend it with like the concealer that's under my eye from the eyeshadow, I'm just taking a blending brush and just blending those two together. To set the concealer in place, I'm using my Anastasia Banana Powder. I'm gonna let that sit on uh, my face for a couple minutes and I'm gonna work on my eyebrows too. I'll be back. I'm taking a powder brush and just dusting this off and like lightly set the rest of my face. I'm gonna bronze my face using this Milani bronzer. For blush, I'm using this Carity Blush Balm. Okay, I forgot where I left off. I kind of just took a break, but I'm actually just applying my lashes right now. For mascara, I'm using these two. This is the Violet One Lash Primer from Milani and the Most Wanted Lashes by Milani. I've been using this primer lately. And it's making my eyelashes look really nice and not ugly how they usually do. I like using this mainly on my lower lashes because they show more than these because these are covered with my lashes, but it really helps to like separate them and like make them look long and nice. Thank you. Before putting my eyelash, I'm going to highlight. I'm using this shadow from, from the Makeup Shack uh, Rainforest Palette. This is my favorite eyeshadow. Look at this. Look at that. Yes. Okay, so this is pretty much it for the tutorial. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. So, um, as I mentioned, I am running a giveaway. If you want to enter um, to win all of this, the rules will be listed down in the description below, uh, or you can just go to my Instagram. All the rules will be listed on the picture on my Instagram. I don't know how to do this. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you guys for supporting me. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!